Today's lesson is about the general ledger accounts. You might think, oh, that's accounting. Kind of a little bit, but in this case, it's good for your reporting and, uh, and checking out where your revenue streams come from. You can find it under admin, under finance, accounting and invoicing. And here's the general ledger accounts. In this particular system, there are already a couple of them have been set up. Hardware, labor, licenses and recurring revenue. Um, I'm going to create a couple of them more so you have a little bit more uh, uh, general reporting inside of your system. Of course, this is all accounting wise. So most likely your accounting software or even your, your bookkeeper or your accountant has a, a much more broader setup in the accounting software, which is great. Uh, but also we would recommend to have something here in, in Autodesk as well. So you can kind of keep track of, of where your revenue came from and you can report on here. So software is one that we for sure also uh, would like to have in there. There's one that says recurring revenue, which we would kind of uh, rename. Uh, this could be, uh, let's call it the main one that we always have is the managed services, because this would be one big bucket. We want to split it out in managed services. And the other one is the other main portion of your recurring revenue. And that is your other recurring revenue. It could be licenses, what they say over here. It could be also software. Depends a little bit on how you want to uh, book it again. Maybe if you sell a whole bunch of licenses, you might say, okay, I want to keep the one separately. But this is the other one, other recurring services or other recurring revenue. It depends on how you uh, mention it, but this is more in, uh, in line with everything. And now you also have the labor and, and the projects could be underneath that too. So now you have a little bit more setup of some letter accounts that you can use. Uh, these ones will map to what uh, what you will have in your accounting software. That's that's another step. But this is the main setup of your ledger accounts. This way you can have uh, your revenue in Autodesk split up and your reporting will work too. And you can already see in Autodesk where is your revenue coming from instead of waiting for the CPA or your accounting or your accounting software to uh, get that uh, info for you a couple of days later. That's all. If you have any questions, uh, give us a, a comment on our Facebook group and we'll get back to you.